It is Time Management Tuesday, which means that we are sharing all things time management related, especially as it relates to good leadership. You know, one of the books that I've been reading is by Keith Ferrazzi. Keith Ferrazzi wrote the book, Never Eat Alone. And what he's talking about in terms of time management is how can you be a master networker? Well, number one point that he, that he, that he talks about is to lead with how can I help you versus how can you help me. Um, he just believes that relationships are like muscles and you've gotta be able to do this long before you actually need to flex that muscle so you're in great shape, but you also need to be able to lay that ground of, of not only trust, but of generosity and mutual understanding. The second point that he makes is have something to say. When you're networking, we know we're doing a lot of this online right now, have something to say, either skill-wise, have something to say that's personal, have something to say about a trip that maybe you've taken, but just be interesting, have something to say. He talks about how Bill Clinton, our former president, from the age of 22 would actually carry around a little index cards. And after he would meet each person, he would write down notes on this index card. So he had something personal and, and, and intriguing to say to each person that he would meet maybe again in the future somebody's kids' names, their spouse's name, a trip that they took, so on and so forth. And then the third thing, and I really, really love this point, this is forcing me to t think about this, is connect to super connectors. What's a super connector? Well, it's somebody who's in politics, maybe a lobbyist, um, it's someone in journalism, or someone who's in PR. Those people are invested in having a lot of different kinds of contacts. And then finally, those who are in bar and restaurant management. So as you're thinking about what you're gonna be doing these next couple days as you're quarantined in your home or you're working from home and you still wanna be networking, these are some of the tips that you can start to deploy. Go through your LinkedIn, see so who you wanted to meet with and see how you can lead with an attitude of how can I help you in this time of need. Um, we have a workshop coming up this Friday. I wanted you to know about this, but we have a workshop coming up this Friday. And, and, and at its core, you know, we're talking about stepping into your spotlight as a business owner. But what are we really talking about? We're talking about the fact that in order to attract your core client and keep your core client, it's important to keep talking about what you do. And not necessarily do all of us have the tools to be able to talk with aplomb about what it is that we do and who it is that we're looking to help. So in this workshop, we're really gonna hopefully leave you with some tools with how you can talk about yourself, talk about your business in a service-driven way, not in an ego-driven way. All the details are on ladydrinks.com. You can go on any of my social media, it's there. It's definitely down below in the legend. Please hit the like button and subscribe. And every time I upload a video, you're gonna get a little bell notification telling you as much. Tell me what you're doing in this time of crisis. I wanna hear, DM me, comment down below. Bye.